The uh, number is just amazing. Uh, 32,000 acres burned just in, Bur in Bastrop County. Again, 476 homes destroyed so far. And we know that there is another fire burning in another part of Bastrop County in the southwestern part of the county. Um, Katina McHenry has been gathering information for us for, uh, um, on that fire. Katina. Leslie and Robert, good evening. Highway 21 was shut down right at Union Chapel. There was a fire that started there earlier today that reignited this afternoon, which caused fire crews to reassemble and try to put out that fire. Now, we were there earlier today, right before they shut that road down. We talked to a family that lives off of uh, Highway 21. The video you see there is neighbors driving up and down the street, honking their horns, trying to get their other neighbors to evacuate, which is what one of the things that Governor Perry talked about today was until female can get here, they urge everybody to take care of their neighbors and look out for one another. This is the Jones's family. They lived on this particular property for many, many years. Several families lived there, and they were trying to do what they could to evacuate today. They thought they were okay when the fire was put out, but of course that fire reignited and they had to scramble to get their livestock out of that area. And that's what I told my grandson. We dashed the bullet. Now I don't know. This is a gentleman we talked to off of Highway 71 off Leisure Lane, and he was at his home and, of course, went back. He thought everything was okay, went back to his home and then had to evacuate. Also, the Bastrop State Park is on fire right now. 4,000 of the 6,000 acres of that park have already burned right now. They're trying to protect the historical homes and the historical area of that park. They're not sure if they'll be able to save it, but right now they're working to try to put that fire out. Right now, neighbors are just at the mercy of the wind and mother nature. We're live in Bastrop, Katina McHenry, KXAN News.